click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, today we are going to see what is riveting. Riveting is a joining process, it is an allied joining process and what happens you are joining two or more than two objects by using rivets, by using your dowels, by using your screws. So how you do it we are going to see in this video. So basically, I'll just introduce what is a rivet. In this diagram, you can see a rivet. It is a ductile material, purely ductile. You can't use a brittle rivet. It has a head, it has a tail. So head is rounded or of any other shape. The tail is a bit tapered so that it can be easily inserted at the place where you are supposed to insert. Between the head and the tail, the longitudinal part is known as shank. So the rivet consists of a head, tail as well as a shank. So in this diagram you can see a dimensional rivet, proper dimensions are given to that. You can also see in the other diagram there are two plates between which the rivet is mounted. So one of the part is in a single plate, second part is in another place. So two joints are supposed to be joined. Basically when we talk about rivet, you don't need any additional adhesive, you don't need any additional element unlike you use in welding process or in other allied processes like brazing, soldering etc. So in riveting what you have to do, you have to bring your objects together, you have to drill it to get your rivet fit into that and you have to put your rivet, you have to stamp it and your rivet enters and it gets fittest. So if you are drilling a table which is having some dimension, you have to rivet it at two ends, you just have to make a hole, drill it and you have to keep your rivet, you have to dig it like you have to stamp it and it enters and the two tables are joined. So riveting can easily be done using hand tools like you just have to take your rivet, insert it in the hole which is pre drilled you have to take your rivet, insert it in a hole which is pre drilled you can use a hand tool and just pump it like you have to press it basically stamping and then the rivet enters your part and the object is riveted. It is done by hand. Also machine riveting can be done instead of a hand tool which we are using additional machine presser, hammers etc to just rivet it like your tool should get easily inserted in your drilled place. So when I talk about riveting, this diagram shows a zigzag rivet. So you can see there are four to five or six rivets which are kept one above another and the front view of that can be seen at the top. So the front view as well as the top view of a riveted plate, two riveted plates are basically shown in this diagram. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned with Ikeda and do subscribe our channel Ikeda.